Charities in New Haven getting ready for the holiday rush to feed the needy, and this year they are expecting demand to be very big. Last year, the Connecticut Food Bank handed out more than 18 million pounds of food, and this year it looks like they are going to need even more. And they need your help to do it. News 8's Allie Reed has more on the building demand. Food is piling up at the Connecticut Food Bank's warehouse in East Haven. The organization, which regularly distributes food to more than 600 shelters throughout the state, is gearing up for its busiest season. We know that the need is great. It's, I anticipate it's going to be greater this year. Last Thanksgiving, the organization dished out 25,000 turkeys and a quarter of a million pounds of fixings. This year, Nancy says the help is more urgent. Plenty of Connecticut farms have pitched in with bags of fresh produce here, but it's the baggage in Washington that's really affecting residents, and that's why the Connecticut Food Bank says this year's need is greater than ever. The government shutdown has meant some Connecticut workers have had to go without pay, which has many turning to local food pantries for the first time. For situations where uh, they were already living on a shoestring, losing just one day's wages can be critical. But while the shutdown has produced greater need, it has also cut funds to the organization. The Connecticut Food Bank receives $300,000 each year from the government. That money is currently not available to them because of the shutdown, and they're not sure if they'll ever see it. For the moment, that food, that uh, resource is on hold. We're not sure if and when we will see that money and whether we will lose some of it. If they don't see that money, she says they'll need to rely more on private donations. If you'd like to help, head to our website, WTNH.com. In East Haven, Allie Reed, News 8.